made in Hollywood. Now available on demand. Gerard Butler will stop at nothing to save his family as humanity faces an extinction level event in the apocalyptic thriller Greenland. Hey, I'm Gerard Butler. You're watching Made in Hollywood, and here is a scene from Greenland. Is this Clark, this uh, know, interstellar right? comet? Right? I mean, it's, yeah, it's big news. Right. Just what are they saying? The More of the same. Well, I bet you it's going to make a heck of a show. Whoa! Where are they going? I don't know. I feel like you're no stranger to action movies, but this role of John Garrity is different than, for instance, Mike Banning. I feel like Mike Banning is trained. You know, he's highly trained when he gets into these situations. But John Garrity, an, he's an everyman. He's a father. He, you know, he's an engineer. Um, but he doesn't have any specific talents that will help him in, in this situation, which immediately makes it more about the heart and the passion and the protective nature. Um, and it allowed it to become a more internal complex journey between myself and Morena and the family um, and trying to find this way through to, to survival. So I, 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 I loved it. When the first chunk is about to hit. Hit? Only part of it. It's going in the ocean. Two. Would you look at that? One. Wait, where's the explosion? Now, scientifically, is this really possible? A comet can hit Earth, it could be a total extinction event? Look, yeah. in 2020, anything's possible. It has happened all the way. You know, what, what are we on our sixth great extinction? And I think four of the previous five were all um, hits from outer space. Uh, not, not comets, but asteroids. And, and they're flying around us all the time. We just saw a comet, one just missed the Earth, and they say one might, there's a 1% chance of hitting the Earth in about a month and a half. So yeah, it's possible. We now are getting word that the fragment has hit Central Florida. Oh my God. Wait, are some more pieces gonna hit? Come on, let's go. But the sky's on fire. This major catastrophe, world catastrophe, starts to happen and she's given a choice, you know, does she run, does she give up? Um, does she fight for her family? And I enjoy, I really like this character is incredibly active and passionate um, and, and that her family is everything to her. And that's something that I could really relate to. Space agencies are predicting an extinction level event. We're gonna be together, all right, kiddo? We're just trying to get to safety. They've been tracking the military flights to bunkers in Greenland. It's their only chance. When you're actually shooting the movie, what are you seeing? When we're seeing these comets in this sky that's ablaze, what are you guys actually seeing? <laughs> yeah, not a lot. Maybe uh, a makeup artist walking past with her makeup bag. Up the end. <laughs> Look at the makeup bag. Uh, now, the, dude with a tennis ball. <laughs> we did try to have as many conventional, real special effects as possible, especially with the explosions and crashes, etc. But the actual um, sky itself. No, we. Um, it wasn't really much to look at it. So you just got to use your imagination. What's going on? If you are hearing this broadcast, oh seek shelter John, immediately. Go. Seek shelter immediately. If you Hang are on, hearing Nathan. this broadcast, seek shelter immediately. Seek shelter immediately. Thanks for checking out this video. We want to know what would you have asked? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And as always, for more videos like this, hit the MIH TV logo right here. And for the next awesome video, click right there.